We're here with uh, Terre Haute North coach uh, Chris Barrett. North just beat Castle 27-11 on opening night here at North. Chris uh, looked pretty good. I mean, looked like uh, you know it wasn't a first game form. Uh, offense uh, was crisp, uh, a lot of yards on the ground. Defense, of course, with the big goal line stand right before halftime. But also, you know, bent but didn't break against Castle's passing game. Uh, I would imagine you have to be pretty pleased with this effort. Very pleased. We, we were really worried going into this game. Castle is such a talented football team. It's a, they're so well coached. And just the, that zone offense and their play action off of that is just really hard to stop. And our guys did a great job. You know, we had a lot of question marks defensively with our linebackers and our, our middle front there with our D-line. And guys really answered the call. They prepared, prepared well. They listened. Uh, they actually played better tonight than they practiced against that zone. You know, so uh, and you mentioned the goal line stand. I think that was the deciding factor. You know, when you have two teams that are evenly matched like that and uh, you can create some momentum going into halftime, have a little bit more enthusiasm, and then get the ball coming out, I think that was huge. Yeah, that goal line stand kind of, for lack of a better way to put it, you know, kind of tested the manhood of your defense a little bit. They worked the clock down. You kind of think maybe they're going to, you know, try the field goal down 10-3 at that point, but they decide to go for it, which, mm -hmm. and your defense rose to the challenge. You know, just obviously that had to be huge momentum at halftime, and then your offense turned it around and, and uh, made it into a 14, uh, uh, or I'm sorry, a 17-3 lead at, uh, just after halftime. That was a big change. Well, we, we've got a defensive motto, uh, ground to stand on. It doesn't matter if where we are on the field. If we have ground to stand on, they haven't punched that in, we play 100%. With great effort, great enthusiasm, uh, we, we've been able to train our guys to realize that there's nothing better defensively than a goal line stand. And, and they rose to the occasion, you know, and, and they, they, they played hard. Uh, they got lined up right, and, and they got the job done. You know, offensively, it looked like tonight that, you know, it was an offensive line that has a year under their belt. It's Nick with a year under his belt at quarterback. Logan's been playing running back here now for for uh, three seasons. Mm -hmm. uh, and it looked it. I mean, it, the, the execution was was that of an experienced team. You know, you don't always get it that way, but it seemed to work that way tonight, and obviously that has to be another positive uh, for your team. That's, that's our bread and butter. You know, we start running our power counter game. It's what, it's what we do, it's what we spend most of our time on. Uh, and even even early on when some of those plays were breaking, they, they were a block away here or half a block away here. And, and, our, and our guys really, we cleaned some things up at halftime and then we started busting it during the second half. Plainfield's a team you haven't played because they're new to the schedule. Um, I'm pretty sure they lost to uh, Avon tonight, but uh, new challenge, new team, probably a team you don't know a terrible huge amount about at this stage of the game, but your team does have momentum going over there, and obviously that's a good start. Good start. It's always great to get that first win. Uh, you're right. I don't know hardly anything about Plainfield. We're going to have to do a lot of work. You know, we've been, we've been preparing for Castle for six, seven, eight weeks, and we're going to have to cram this in about three or four days. So a lot of work to do. Uh, I'm sure they're very good. I'm sure they're well coached. They've got great facilities. They've got everything in place to, to create a great program, and we're, we're, gonna, and we're going over there. So that, that adds a little bit more on our plate. All right, Chris, I appreciate it. Thanks a lot.